Yeah, it starts off in the root of your grass, but after just a couple of months, you could end up with a lot more than just dirt on your hands. There's all kinds of misnomers about them. They, they, they think a mosquito hawk or they eat mosquitoes or whatever. They actually look like giant mosquitoes. So that is, that's what the crane fly is. Turns out crane flies do not eat mosquitoes and they won't bite you, but they will go after the roots of your grass. Crane flies truly are a seasonal pest, so we're going to see um, the adults kind of later in the summer. Crane flies look like large mosquitoes, but they're pretty different. Springtime is when they're most active, but they lay their eggs in the fall. Those eggs mature and develop into larvae, then by the spring. Kind of shake off winter, just like every other insect is doing right now, and they act, they're actively feeding in the lawn. They like shaded or moist areas, but they can also feed in the roots of plants, not just your grass. They could potentially live out an entire life cycle in, in a lawn. So if you've had a problem with them in the past, chances are you'll have a problem with them in the future. He says the only real way to get rid of them is to treat your lawn just like you would with any pest. But there is something you can do to help prevent them from laying their eggs in your lawn. Moisture content, shaded areas, and, and you're not having too, too wet of an area. Which means looking out for wet spots around your sprinklers. Now, if you are concerned that you might have a problem with crane flies, Vander Lowe says to look for short patches of grass. You'll see uneven growing in the grass. That could be a potential sign. Um, if the infestation gets big enough, you could even have like patches in the grass that aren't aren't coming up. So the bottom line is, while crane flies won't hurt you or your pets, they could still cause big problems with your lawn. In Spokane, Shana Walltower, Crime 2 News. Mm -hmm.